Hi everyone. We're going to do a nonlinear system type problem with this word problem here. We have the product of two numbers. I'm going to let the two numbers be x and y is 10. So x times y equals 10. The difference of their squares, so I'm going to square each one but subtract, is 21. And I have to find the numbers. So Basically, I'm going to go ahead and solve for x here. I'm going to get x equals 10 over y. And I'm going to substitute this into my x here. So I have 10 over y squared minus y squared equals 21. That's going to be 100 over y squared minus y squared equals 21. Now, to clear this, this out here, I'm going to multiply everything through by y squared. And I'm going to multiply each term by y squared. So you get 100, so 1, 100 minus y to the fourth um, equals 21y squared. Move everything over, so you're going to get, I'm going to move it over to the right, you get y to the fourth minus 21y squared minus 100. This is plus, sorry. So we're going to factor, you're going to get y squared, y squared, and I'm going to do 25 times 4. So this is going to be a plus here, minus here. So our solutions are going to be um, y squared plus 25 equals 0. Well, when you do this, you're going to get y squared equals negative 25. And you take the square root of that, get negative 25, which is i, uh, 5, or 5i, put the i there. And that's not a real solution. So we just want real solutions. That's a complex solution. So I'm only going to use this one. You get y squared minus 4 equals 0. So y squared equals 4. Therefore, y equals plus or minus 4. And I'm going to go ahead and put this all on this page here. So I'll use green. And if y is 4, then you plug in 4 here, and you're going to get um, x, uh, x times 4. Actually, I, did you catch that? This should be plus or minus 2. So it's actually my two solutions for that y. I have two solutions for my y here and they're plus and minus 2. So I'm going to put 2 here or negative 2. So it's going to be x times 2 equals 10 and clearly uh, 5 times 2 equals 10. So this would be 5 and uh, if it's negative 2 it's going to be negative 5. So my x and y can either be, my, my two numbers are 5 and 2, or my numbers are negative 5 and negative 2. Okay? Thank you and have a nice day. Bye-bye.